let's see few more problems on the natural growth and decay if the population is increasing exponentially at the rate of 2 percent per year what will be the percentage increase over a period of 10 years so we have to find out the x when t is equals to 10 years so let the initial population is x naught and by the law of natural growth so here the given that population is increasing it means it's growing so that we had to use a formula x is equals to c into e power kt so let this be as equation number one now at time t is equals to zero x uh, we don't know the x so the x is equals to x naught up so x naught is equals to c into e power k into zero so then x naught is equals to c and now substitute this c value in equation one x is equals to x naught into e power kt b as equation number 2. Now, uh, the given that is, uh, it is uh, population is increasing exponentially at the rate of 2% per year. So, per year, nothing but at time t is equals to 1 year, it is increasing 2%. So, increasing 2% means to the initial one, the 2% is added. That is, x is equals to x naught plus 2 x naught percent. So, x naught plus 2 x naught uh, percent nothing but 1 by 100. So, this is 1 uh, 100 x uh, 100 into x naught that is 100 x naught plus 2 x naught that is 102 x naught by 100. Now, now substitute in a second equation uh, 102 x naught by 100 is equals to x naught e power k into 1. So, here x naught will be cancelled. 102 by 100 is equals to e power k. So, from this when we remove the exponential here, we get the logarithm. Logarithm of 1 by 2, oh sorry, 10, uh, 102 by 100 is equals to k. So, this is a k value. So, at time t is equals to 10 years, we have to find out the x. So, x is equals to x naught into e power log of 102 by 100 into 10. So, x is equals to x naught e power 10 or 10 into log of 102 by 100. So, x is equals to x naught into, uh, when we know that e power log f of x can be written as f of x. And we know that n into log x can be written as x power n. So, applying the same formula here, n into, uh, that is 10 into log of 102 by 100 can be written as log of 102 by 100 whole power 10. So, e power log f of x can be written as f of x. That is 10 into 1. Sorry, here you don't get 10. So, 102 by 100 whole to the power of 10. Now, x is equals to x naught into 102 by 100 whole to the power of 10. You will get it as 1.218. So, x is equals to x naught into 1.218 into 100. Because we need the percentage since uh, because uh, we, we have to multiply with the 100. So, then we get x is equals to 121.8 percent. So, this is a percentage. So, when we subtract the 100 from this, then we get 21.8. This approximately equal to 22. So, the increase in the population is 22 percent. That is x. Now, the second question. If money is invested at 5 percent, Compounded continuously in how many years will the money double in value? So here L at x is equals to c into e power k t b as equation number 1. Now at t is equals to 0, x is equals to x naught. So x naught is equals to c into e power k into 0 and x naught is equals to c. So the c value is x naught. Now substitute in the equation 1, we get x is equals to x naught into e power k t. And let this be as equation number 2. So, at t is equals to 1, uh, in 1 year, uh, x is equals to x naught plus 5 x naught percent. So, 5 percent, it's got increased. So, x naught plus 5 by 100 into x naught. So, 100 x naught plus 5 x naught. That is 105 x naught by 100. So, 105 by 100 is equals to x naught is equals to x naught into e power k into t is 1. So, here uh, when you remove the law, uh, here x naught will be cancelled and uh, when you remove the exponential then you will get the log. Log of 105 by 100 is equals to k. So, this is a k value. So, at 
x is equals to 2 x naught the double it got double so at what time the value will be double so that is x is equals to 2 x naught what is the time they are asking so now substitute these values in the equation 2 so 2 x naught is equals to x naught e power log of 1 naught 5 by 100 into t x naught will be cancelled so 2 is equals to e power log of 1 naught 5 by 100 into t so when you remove the exponential here then you will get the log log 2 is equals to log of 1 naught 5 by 100 into t now send this log of 1 naught 5 by 100 to the left hand side so log 2 by log of 1 naught 5 by 100 is equals to t so when you do the calculation t is equals to 14.3 so 14.3 nothing but 14 years plus 3 months so this will be the time then third question if 30% of radioactive substance disappears in 10 years, how long it takes for 90% of it to disappear? So, they given that the disappears. So, it means it got decreasing. So, by the law of natural decay, we have the formula x is equals to c into e power minus k into t. So, let this be as equation number 1. So at time t is equals to 0, x is equals to x naught, then x naught is equals to c into e power minus k into 0, x naught is equals to c, then substitute this three value in equation 1, that is x naught x is equals to x naught into e power minus k t b as equation number 2. So at time t is equals to 0, so in uh, to disappear the 10 30 percent of the radioactive substance, it takes 10 years. So at time t is equals to 10 x is equals to x naught minus 30 x naught percent so it's disappearing we have to use the minus here so so here percent nothing but by 100 so x naught minus 30 by 100 into x naught is equals to uh, 100 x naught minus 30 x naught that is 70 x naught by 100 now substitute here 70 by 100 x naught is equals to x naught into e power minus k into t is 100 so here x naught will be cancelled 70 by 100 is equals to e power minus 10k so when you remove the exponential here you will get the logarithm log of 70 by 100 is equals to minus 10k so k is equals to minus 1 by 10 log of 70 by 100 so this is the k value so uh, the question is how long it takes to disappear the 90 percent so we have to find out the time so to disappear the 90 percent x naught minus x naught uh, 90 x naught percentage so it we have to find out so x naught minus 90 by 100 into x naught and 100 x naught minus 90 x naught that is 10 x naught by 100 so substitute here uh, 10 by 100 into x naught is equals to x naught e power minus of k value is minus 1 by 10 log of 70 by 100 into t so 1 by 10 is equals to x naught will be cancelled so 1 by 10 is equals to e power minus into minus plus 1 by 10 log of 70 by 100 into t. So log of 1 by 10 is equals to when you remove the exponential you get log. Log of 1 by 10 is equals to t by 10 log of 70 by 100. So t this can be written as uh, send this log of 70 by 100 to the left hand side. Log of 1 by 10 by log of 70 by 100 is equals to t by 10. Then this t multiplies with the numerator. When you uh, find the calculation of this, you get 66.6 so years. So to disappear the 90% of the radioactive cell, uh, substance, it takes 66 point years. Nothing but 66 years plus 6 months. Let's see the final question. Uh, radium decomposes at a rate proportional to the amount present if 5% of the original amount disappears in 50 years how much will remain after 100 years so here 5% uh, of the original amount disappears in 50 years so at time t is equals to 50 years it disappears the 5% of the radium then uh, how much will remain we have to find out the x uh, when t is equals to 100 years so here we know that it decomposes decomposes nothing but decreasing so by the law of natural decay x is equals to c into e power minus kt and let this be as equation number one so at time t is equals to zero x b as x naught 
So x naught is equals to c into e power minus k into zero. X naught is equals to c. This is a c value. Substitute in this one first equation. Uh, x is equals to x naught e power minus k t b as equation number two. Now at time t is equals to fifty. X is equals to x naught minus phi x naught percent. So it it got disappeared. We have to use the minus here. So here ninety five by hundred into x naught. So percent is nothing but you get the divided by hundred. So hundred x naught minus five x naught. That is ninety five x naught by hundred. Substitute in this. You get ninety five by hundred x naught is equals to x naught into e power minus k into fifty. So ninety five by hundred is equals to x naught will be cancelled e power minus fifty k. So log of ninety five by hundred when you remove the exponential you get the logarithm. Log of ninety five by hundred is equals to minus fifty k. So from this k value is equals to minus one by fifty. Log of ninety five by hundred. Now we got the c value and the k value. Uh, by the using the second condition, that is, um, we had to find out the x when t is equals to hundred years. So substitute the values of k and t value, you will get the x. So at time t is equals to hundred years, x is equals to uh, how much? We had to find out. So x is equals to x naught into e power one by fifty log of ninety five by hundred into hundred. So x is equals to x naught e power Hundred by fifty log of ninety five by hundred. So x is equals to x naught e power hundred by fifty is two log of ninety five by hundred. So here we know n into log x can be written as log x power n and e power log x power n can be written as x power n. So x is equals to x naught into ninety five by hundred whole square. So x is equals to we, when you solve this you get this zero point nine zero x naught. So we when we multiply with hundred we get ninety x naught percent. So hundred minus ninety x naught hundred plus hundred minus ninety that is ten percent of the radium decomposes in hundred years. So in hundred years the decomposition percentage is ten percent. So whatever the questions I have explained those are very important. If you be perfect with the Newton's law of cooling and the natural law of uh, growth and decay. Uh, you can attempt the one question from the first unit. So these are the very most important. Practice this well, and thank you.